go to the baby shop. I'm uh, choosing to have like this natural start with the baby and it's like something they do here in Holland. You get like a nurse in your home and they take like they help you with the baby and everything. You can choose for like natural like somebody that's specialized in like natural care or whatever um, and yeah just there's all these things that that you then need to buy like lavend lavendel lavend lavender lavender so yeah you get all this this stuff there they ha they sell like special oils but also um like the wool and stuff the wool like wool that you can put the baby in and like yeah so i'm really curious about this so we'll see but we'll Cammy will take i'm sure Cammy will take you guys with us right yeah okay let's go see you later okay we're here we have arrived charlotte specifically asked me not to film as we walk in because she's a little bit embarrassed <laughs> so we're in the baby shop and <laughs> We're getting a nice refreshment. I'm gonna have a coffee. What are you having? A water. A water. Look how cute. What is that? That's so nice. Oh, this is the wool my mom is talking about. It's nice. It's a nice shop. Yeah. Oh, wow, this is nice. Yeah. That's what you want, though, no? this kind of yeah. style. How much is it? And this is the box. Yeah, oh, yeah, nice. Yeah. Quite like that one. And yeah. also, that's nice. <laughs> Can we buy everything today? Yeah. I love grandma. And this silk is it. made from... Silk. From this? Yeah, ah, it's okay. made from that same. Okay. And that are colored with products from nature. Nice. Mm. And this is what my mom was talking about, right? Yeah. This exactly. merino. Also, yeah. yeah. And very soft oil. Mm. And they make them warm. And, okay, that's and this is chamomile. Yeah. Okay. And this is lavender. Yeah. Nice. And then this is an example of the baby. <laughs> Test if he's hungry. <laughs> this is the package. Okay. Of the first position mm -hmm. to um, in your delivery uh, time, uh, and that's all natural. Oh yeah, I see here, uh, natural birth is Biological, there's the um, Camilla okay. to drink tea. Okay. Uh, there are, um, you make this with Camilla oil. Mm. Okay. You put on the belly of the baby. Oh. You make it warm first, then the wool, and then the bandage. This mm. is a brush molten, and the brush molten, they, they is a, a sort of a cotton, mm. and that's uh, that the warmth of the silk go into the belly for the baby. That's very important. And why why do they need that? If they have cramps. For cramps. cramps. Ah, yeah. okay. Yeah. And, and then you decide on this way, and then you can get your diaper <laughs> in it. Diaper from cotton. Oh yeah. Oh, that's what I was talking about. This is what you wanted, mm -hmm. right? And this is a position from a diaper. Okay. That everything fits from the little baby until there are. One year. Oh really? Oh, yeah, okay, because nice. you have that. So how does that work? How <laughs> oh, do you wow. how do you clean how do you clean that? Um, you can wash them in okay. the machine and normally buy uh, five uh, boxes of five pieces. Yeah. And then you have to wash comfortable for the baby. Yeah. Mm. And then you make the higher position. And it's very comfortable for the baby. Yeah, it's so much Not more so comfortable than yeah. the diapers. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's all I have to yeah. have to know make it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, this, so this looks fun. a lot easier with a doll than it would be with, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. with a real also. baby though. <laughs> or your stomach. Yeah. It's not so uh, very good on this yeah. one. They don't have um, the, rash. Uh, the skin. Yeah, like the skin. Diaper rash. Diaper, diaper rash. rash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And is there like a package with everything with also this and the diaper in it, or uh, mm -hmm. it's just... This is nice. Yeah, that's something that I want, definitely. Yeah, I really like that. And what's this? That's like a sheet for that's a thing for it to go in the box. Oh, but this is cute, though. This one, with the lion. Yeah, that is cute. For a boy. Where? What would you do if the baby's head turned around right now? <laughs> Oh, I definitely want him to have this style of bedroom. Like, this is cool if his little friends from school come over. Mm 
Babies are expensive. Is it not going to be too warm in the summer? No, no. I feel like we're going to have like a... The shoes, yeah. It's in the Zoke and that in the same color. 5,000 pounds liar. Hey, bro! Hey, bro! Oh, look at you! Hey! 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 And how old is she? She's eight! Oh my goodness, I really want one! <laughs> hey! See ya! Oh, I'm so happy that she's yeah, got a haircut. June. Are you happy with her hair? Yeah. Like I'm happy that she's like clean and bald, bald again. <laughs> she, I can tell that she's like a, a little bit traumatized, a little bit. <laughs> I can't see it from all the shopping bags. <laughs> oh. That is cute. It's so soft. Obviously, we're having the baby in Holland, not in the UK. And the way they do things over here is super different. I think I've already said this in a vlog before. It's like a little bit closer to like more private care. And a lot of a lot of uh, women over here choose to, first of all, deliver at home. Like that's quite a popular thing here, delivering at home. And in Scotland and in the UK in general, that's not as common. Some people do it, but it's not as common. But here, it's quite popular that people deliver at home. And that's what Charlotte would like to do is deliver at home then the next thing that the that you choose is what kind of medical attention or what kind of process that you like and if that's going to be more what's it like what's the, the two different decisions what do you mean like natural or what natural or normal natural or normal <laughs> not too not too difficult but obviously the way charlotte is and the kind of girl she is she wants to go for a natural delivery and a natural natural like start start like a natural start for the for the baby and another really cool thing i love about the dutch system is for a couple of weeks or a week after having yeah, giving giving birth a week one week after you get this really hot well not always hot but in my head you get this nurse that comes mm -hmm. and stays with you for a week and she cooks, she cleans, she looks after the baby, she teaches you things about the baby. Yeah. And because we're going for the natural care, she does everything naturally. So Oh, she's spe she specialized to in the natural care basically, which is different. So yeah, she so whatever start you choose, normal or natural, they specialize in that. And the start that the baby baby has in that first week in the world will be all with natural ingredients and it will be with like wool, merino wool and it's all about different temperatures as well. It's yeah, all it's about, about warmth. Like about warmth. It's really important that the baby stays like warm and that's also why they're using the wool and just all natural eco-friendly products. At the shop today that we filmed earlier, that's in that realm, in that whole organic natural start thing. So everything that we've kind of got at the shop today is all with this merino wool and there's like an actual process of what the baby has to wear like um different layers of like different types of wool and silk and it's all to do with the temperature and yeah it's pretty cool but i just thought like it's really nice for us to to, to film this because for one reason we love looking back at them even we've not been vlogging for that long but even looking back at vlogs six months ago it's super nice but the main reason that kind of hits home for me is that we're living in Holland and my family are back in Scotland my mum's in New Zealand and we're doing all these things for the baby and it's so nice to kind of involve the family and let them kind of be a part of this mm. whole journey but also on another level what's super nice is that for anyone that's maybe going through pregnancy or thinking about having a baby then it's nice for us to share this stuff that we're doing yeah like the natural star and the wool and I guess it's just like so different in Scotland but if anyone has any questions I by no means am qualified to answer those questions but um Charlotte used to be a midwife so she knows quite a lot of a wow. lot of stuff about babies um and also the process that we're going through if anyone has any questions that they might want to ask then I'm happy to answer them also
natural birth essentials. Yeah, this so is this like is, the starter pack. Yeah, this is, oh, this is the delivery bag actually. This is the delivery bag. So I actually don't know exactly what's in it. So it's also quite interesting for us. So this is, I mean, this is not really like that, something that people want to know, but this is like maternity pads. <laughs> Pants. Pads. 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 With a D. Pads. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, this is, what is this then? That's one of the, There's, like this the... This is woolen. So this is merino wool and it's um, the... <gasps> Oh my goodness, that that's soft though, that, I haven't felt this oh, yet. Oh yeah, that's nice. Also one thing that the woman told us, which is like, I think that's quite interesting, um, is that the fabric is cleans itself, so you don't have to wash it basically. So like this, the merino wool which I still find hard to believe. that we've bought is like antibacterial and basically so. what she was saying is that you can leave it on the windowsill on the sun and in one day it's it's absorbed and it's gotten rid of all the bacteria or something. Maybe you need to do your own research on that, but <laughs> we definitely will be. But but yeah, maybe we just got absolutely <laughs> scammed. <laughs> I do believe her though. She was like really, she was good though. But like, do you know what's so funny to think? Yeah. Is see all this that we're filming right now. Yeah. In a few years, he'll be able to watch this. Yeah. And he's not even born. So can we like make a little moment for like lift your belly up? Lift my belly up. <laughs> <laughs> lift the bag up. Hey, uh, can we say the name or no? No. Okay. Not. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Just if you're watching this, and we're in the future right now, you're in here. You're actually in here right now. He's literally responding. Yeah? Yeah. Holy sh Can you feel it? But yeah, that is, like, that's blowing my mind a bit. Wow. That, like, in, a, let's say, like, three, four years, he, he could watch that yeah. and see that he's in there. You can explain why this is. Why is that the ones for your nipples or no? <laughs> no, it's for my... What was the stuff that she was saying about rubbing your nips? <laughs> what was that? But you know what's really funny? These can go in the food bin. <laughs> Hand soap. Okay. Okay. Scam. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is chamomile oil. Chamomile oil. Alcohol. Alcohol? <laughs> yeah, for like, if you have to clean something. Oh yeah, this is, um, this is like pads for like, for the delivery. So this, you put this like, when I'm like delivering the baby, you put this under, under my bum, basically for all the blood and stuff and that pain. comes out. <laughs> Yeah, this is a, uh, or for your feet, like a uh, relaxing uh, bath for your feet with like um, magnesium salt or something. But that's also something that the natural like care or natural start. Also for mom, for the mother, they like the nurse, they give like feet rub uh, with like lavender oil and all these like things okay. to make also mom feel better. Because if mom feels good, then baby feels good. This is like, Fresh caramel for okay. caramel tea. Nice. It's something like some sort of wool, anyways. Okay, here. But they've somehow managed to make it look like sexy or something. <laughs> Do you not think? It's see? like something that Scottish girls would wear at Halloween. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. <laughs> literally, have seen girls wear that at Knox. I literally have seen that. No, you haven't. I have. Okay, and this is a different kind of wool. What's this? Oh. What is that? A crystal. Oh, nice. Oh. What? Nappies. So this really is like a starter pack then. Yeah. Really small nappies, and it's also natural. And what's this thing? Wipes. Oh, wipes. I thought it was a biscuit. I'm actually really hungry. <laughs> We're getting everything ready for your little bro to arrive. Are you looking forward to him coming? Are you looking forward to him coming? Yeah? Are you looking forward to him arriving so you can say hello to him? We've decided that we're going to try and there's probably people that are already parents just now laughing at this but well like not laughing but like thinking yeah like good luck or something but like we're gonna try and do cotton diapers no not cotton wool 
natural diapers, woolen diapers. Well, it's it's, it's the, the most important part about it is that that's using like nappies for the environment and also that for you're not skin throwing them the out and stuff. Yeah, and also for the skin of the baby is better. But yeah, this is, is this the it? this is a nappy, so you have to wrap them in. Try this? on juniper. No. This you put in lay in a nappy. It's like a really soft material that you can then wash as well. And then this is the wrapper. This is the thing that goes over it. I really, when I seen that, I <laughs> genuinely thought that that was for. I, well, I don't know what it was for. I originally thought it was for dogs. That's how weird of shape <laughs> it is. Oh yeah, that's cute to show. Woolen socks. Nice. Oh yeah, merino wool. Shoes. So this is basically washable as well. You put it in, in hot water and a bit of hot water, and that's how you clean their bum, basically. Oh really? So you don't what, have, you clean their bum. So with you this? don't need to buy any wipes for them. Oh wow! Yeah, it's like really good for their skin and. And rather, this is made from merino wool as well. Yeah. Oh, interesting. <laughs>